lovely day. <coughs> so yesterday was like, what, 20 degrees or so. Today it's cloudy, so yeah. But today we are going to have a vlog. We haven't had a vlog on the channel for a long, long time. And we are going ooh, to look at a car in Ipswich. Because like I said last week, um, Nick had an accident, etc, etc. So yeah, but it was a video last week or so. Oh, right. um, so yeah, so a few of you guys have asked for a vlog. Because uh, we haven't had any in a while. And I thought this would be a nice little change to the channel. Uh, sorry I haven't been uploading as many as much content as I have been. Um, had a lot of things going on, uh, changing jobs, and a lot of opportunities are coming to the channel, uh, which I can't wait about, really. But this week we should be back to normal, should be getting probably three videos out this week, and that should be going on as normal. So, um, be given a nice location to be able to film as well, which is awesome. Uh, thank you for letting me do that, if you're watching. Um, I can't wait to announce some stuff, but we're gonna go pick up Tom, and we're gonna go whip stitch and look at this car. What car is it? An Audi A1, so yeah, let's go get Tom. Here we have Nicola trying to work the sat nav. It's built in on our car. Oh, I don't really know. Ah! Oh. And now we have a Tom. We have a Tom with a diamond on him because he's a diamond. What? Oh! What? Hilaire. Hilaire. How's yeah. things? Not bad, not bad. Good. Spell out town. Well, no. Maybe? It's a problem because you can't back and spill. Yeah, but I don't want to spill out of town, I want to do a whole road. Just do postcode. Yeah, but then postcode could be a long place. And it's not even giving me a postcode. It should give you a postcode. Oh, stop. Look, it's just giving the same to Goddard Road East. Oh, what more should I do? She can't even work a sat nav. Oh, what? Oh, whatever. Right. God. You just see Tom casually in the back. Join a crew with the sunglasses. The, like UK weather is so unpredictable. It oh, was really like here. overcast when we it's come out working. like a couple of minutes ago. Now the sun's out. Now it's going in again. Oh, uh, it's not even hot. It's like mild but cold, and windy, and the I UK's weather. But it's bright, which makes no sense. Are you still in? struggling? I just can't type in a road. I may have to help her with this. What? Suzuki Swift, that bike on it just looks so stupid. Back and more and shit. That's a huge one. Oh, that's a comment. Take the third I haven't seen a comment in years. So we have made it, no. but we want to get food first. So, conveniently, there is a roundabout just before the dealership that we're looking for, and it's got KFC and Costa, Costa and all sorts. So, we're going to get some KFC and then get a Costa and then go look at this car. But we didn't die. So, congrats to you. Congrats. Congrats to Nick's driving. We didn't die. Don't forget I got to the window. Fucking good driving car. Thank you. Fucking yeah. I didn't die. Fucking KFC can Fucking Kentucky Fright. What? Did you say that? Nothing. Chocolate bat, yeah, not too good. Eat chocolate. Fuck yeah. Come here, please, baby. Oh, yeah, huge gravy. I've got a bottle of water. Because I'm driving after all day. Coffee enters my soul. So. Bobby! Thanks, And then. We the are right, all there. refreshed. Coffee, like the first sip of coffee in the morning touches my soul, even though it's the afternoon. But I need coffee to live. I, I absolutely love coffee. Um, and we've got some food, so now we are actually going to get to the dealership and have a look at this Audi A1. But according to where we are, we should only be around the corner. Um, but yeah, let's go see this fucking Audi. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. So many cars. So we're here just having a look around, trying to find the entrance, which I know sounds daft, but there was no customer parking or anything, so we managed to park somewhere else. And this weather can't decide what it wants to do. One minute it's cloudy, one minute it's a Sunday. Uh, Sunday? And then it's a minute it's sunny. I think you're going into like, the service area, babe. There's a guy coming here. Hello. Aha. Aha, success. Did you with me? 
car. It's a really nice car. It's an S line. Oh, BMWs, all sorts. We've got a real nice Merc, uh, Merc Range Rover. But yeah, Nicholas come for the Audi A1, which I'll show you in a second. Um, but yeah, lots of cars. Bad boy. 47 grand. Unfortunately, it's not the car that Nick's looking at, but it would be amazing if it was. But you have got everything in there. Look how nice that is. One day. The car Nick's looking at, little Audi A1. It's a nice little car, to be fair. I quite like them. I mean, I've got, I've got an Audi myself. Blue A4 as a run around. I'm looking for a new car this year, but I think this would be really nice for Nick in terms of size. It's really nice. I'll show you from the front. New 11 plate. Look at that. I love Audi fronts. No, I think it'll be a really nice car for Nick. She's just going to decide to speak to the guy about options and things. I think she's going to take it for a test drive. But look, I think that's a lovely car. Lovely. They've got some real nice motors here. Um, it's like I said, it's in Ipswich. Never been here before, but hopefully. Uh, Nick's going to enjoy the car when she takes it for a test drive. Um, she's panicking a little bit. Well, not panicking, but fluttering a little bit because once the insurance pays out for her accident she had, she has to give the hire car back. So she's running out of time to get a new car. And she has a heart set on an Audi A1, and I think they're lovely motors. And hopefully she can afford it. Hopefully she likes it when she test drives it. But yeah, what do you think, Tom? Very nice car. <laughs> Yeah, I wish I could afford the range in the background, but I haven't got 50 Gs, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, let's see how she gets on the test drive. So, Nicola's gone for her test drive with the, the guy selling it. Um, seems like a really nice guy, good at his job. Um, but yeah, me and Tom decided to stay because we wanted Nicola, she doesn't know the area, we don't want her flustering about um, where she's driving with us in the car making comments, or not making comments, but our comments on the car. I want her to be able to have a nice drive, enjoy it, and actually focus on it if she likes the drive of the car rather than where she's going and having all these people in the car. So she's gone for that. Um, and then, yeah, but no, it looks like a, an absolute bargain. It's the cheapest one on Auto Trader. We asked loads of questions of as to why it was so cheap, but it seems like it all clocks out, and hopefully she enjoys it because it is a really nice car. Um, but me and Tom are just looking at other cars because now we're here, I want to buy one. So I don't know what I want. I don't know what I can afford. She's back, she didn't crash it, and she really enjoyed driving it. So, we're having one last look, which I think is a really nice car. Um, she's just talking to her mum, telling everyone about it. And then, yeah, we're just gonna sit inside, see what the details are, and see what she has to do. But um, I think it's been successful. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, no, they've been really helpful here. Um, and it's, it just looks like everything she wants, so hopefully she's all right. Um, but now she's bought a car, or buying a car, I really want to see what I can get for my money. Um, and I want to see what I can afford to. So let's have a look at some more cars. Paperwork, and coffees, and teas, and random car. And something else. How will you what find you this experience, Tom? What do you Tom? think I should do? So... <laughs> Go in. so I just got my car. <laughs> I won't be able to pick it up until Thursday, but I'm really excited. Spent three hours in there. Yeah, but, but he he was so thorough, and he went through everything there was to go through, explained everything to me in detail, and it's it's like an amazing deal. So I'm really happy. Yeah, for like the first time I've ever been into a car dealership. He didn't chat too much shit. He did his job, but he went for everything, so we knew everything. It was very transparent. It's very hard to come by, so that was quite nice. And now I want to buy a car. <laughs> I want to buy a car. I'm really excited to pick it up on birthday. Your experience, Tom? I must have had to sleep twice. <laughs> did you actually? It was long. <laughs> I've worked tonight. <laughs> um, Sorry. But overall, yeah, it was. He, he said all the right things in the right places. Very smart I car. I didn't expect to be here for so long. Buying cars takes time. I'll buy the car, so... Yeah, you said the quick chip... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we did say a quick trip to a switch, but we didn't we didn't expect to actually Four come hours. away with a car. Um, <laughs> oh shit, I've still got my uh, coffee Who's in left there. anything there? Ah, I'll be alright. But yeah, so... It's not coffee anymore. Now, we have to go home, take time home, so we can get some sleep for work till later, and then Nicola has a physio appointment in Dunmo, so I'll be driving there. It's not got uh, sunglasses on. <laughs> Yeah, this weather has been ridiculous. Sunny 
and then cloudy and then oh but it's been an eventful day and hopefully we don't hit rush hour traffic when we go now so i'll let you guys know what's happening in a little while right so we have just got back from ipswich really excited to get my car it's so pretty um yeah so we're on our way to great dumbo but we popped home so we can swap cars because i don't know if i'm gonna be able to drive um like after my physio because if they're gonna like pull me about or tell me to do this exercise or that don't exercise do, yeah but i don't i mean i work with physiotherapists at work but that's for people like broken hips <laughs> so <laughs> i don't really know what they're gonna do with the back so yeah so i thought it would just be safer for jay to drive just in case i really hurt plus i'm pretty tired anyway from driving all day like i drove what hour there hour back just under an hour back and then also done the test drive in the car so so yeah thought we'd swap cars go there hopefully that won't take too long so i'm getting a bit hungry i don't know about you yeah i'm hungry and then we'll come home and have some dinner dinner i can gym gym with a physio room fucking yeah it looks well nice but Nick has got herself into some pain. She's not going to do. Nappy knack knack. So how was it? What? Oh. It was just really weird. Like, she basically assessed me, like, asked me loads of questions. Um, how the accident happened, where's my pain, how long's my pain been for. Um, and then I had to do a lot of stretches to see, like, so she could determine, like, where it was and everything. We got a free massage. I know. She got a free massage. <laughs> free massage. I do actually ache now, like my neck and my back. I don't know whether it's because of the massage or. Maybe. Maybe it is. But yeah, so I would have recorded, but she had to take a top off. So, as much as some of you probably want to see that, I ain't recording it. But we put you in for next week. Yeah. Um, and one thing that's been really positive out of this whole accident thing is the benefits you're getting. Yeah. from the insurance like you're getting the free physio and stuff like that it's absolutely incredible um, I can't fault that and it's nice that you're not you're, you're being looked after through an accident wasn't your fault rightly so mm. but I know a lot of people that go through all this and have to pay for X amount of things and, and do things on a regular basis just because of it so I'm really happy yeah. no, she's a nice lady yeah, she, she knows what really talking nice. about you know, you're awesome yeah. but it's time for food I'm hungry. This motherfucker's got to eat something. <laughs> right, guys. So, I don't know what the lighting's like in here. It probably looks really bad. So, we're just going to have some dinner now. And I'm probably going to call it a night. Um, it's been a really eventful day. And I hope the video's turned out alright. So, if you did like the video, please leave a like button. It means a massive amount to me. We're nearly at halfway of my uh, year goal of 1,000 subscribers, which is absolutely mental. So I want to thank everyone for liking, sharing, subscribing, talking about it. It's, it's unbelievable. Um, and also, I want you to comment below if you think I should get an Audi A5 or a Mercedes C-Class, because I'm stuck on between. Uh, I kind of know what limit I can go to. And out of the two cars, I really don't, can't decide. So comment below what you'd prefer to get if you had the choice and um, we'll go on that so if you did like the video please leave a like see you guys soon peace